G'day and welcome to Aussie Vision. Uh, today we're talking about the three big national finals happening for Super Saturday or Super Sunday here in Australia. Um, they are the national finals in Norway, Finland and in Spain as well. So we're going to go through our predictions and also some of the favourites from the Aussie Vision team which actually match up quite well. So let's start with the big one, Norway, Melody Grand Prix. So we all kind of think this is probably going to be a head-to-head -head battle between Kano and Tix. We've got the Eurovision stars of Kano, Televote winners of 2019, versus the Spotify local sort of star in itself with Tix. Now, he's released his English version of his song, Fallen Angel, so we haven't seen that live, but we have heard the recorded version. Sounds really good. Um, Tix is a personal favorite of mine and a few of the team, but it was the number one song in the Aussie Vision rankings out of the team all up. Quite comfortable in the end, actually. Uh, Tix was third with the team, while Rayleigh was in second place, but we do probably think it is going to come down to that Kano versus Tix battle. Now, who's actually going to take out the title? Well, I think for the majority of the team, everyone bar one, and definitely myself, we do think Kano is going to take this out in the end. Um, basically, that domestic market of wanting to do well of Eurovision, it's a proven song here, and I think that's going to get over the line, particularly with 100% online televote as well. Chuck the jury in there, and it kind of may have been a different story, but 100%, uh, we're going to back Kano to take it out and book this second um, spot at Eurovision. So moving over the border to Finland and UMK. Now, with the Aussie Vision team, the rankings for us was it was first for Blind Channel, the rock song with um, Dark Side. Uh, second place was actually Oscar with Lie. But I actually don't think that's going to be the battle. I think it's going to be between Teflon Brothers and uh, Blind Channel, the rock song. Teflon Brothers with I Love You, it's the very kind of cheesy, uh, fun, jingly kind of crazy frog song. Um, and I think that's really infectious and fun and people should enjoy that. 25% jury though, so that could make a big difference here, I think. Um, even if they win the tally vote, may not do so well with the juries, particularly as we have international juries, and of course the song is mainly in, in Finnish, except for that chorus, which is a very catchy little English number. Um, we haven't seen uh, Blind Channel go live yet. If they can smash this out, there is appeal on both sides of jury and tally vote, and they could certainly send rock back to Eurovision for Finland. However, don't discount Axel, who's back again this year. Really nice song, should have some sentiment with the Finnish people, but also it's a nice friendly jury song as well. And that also goes for Oscar with his song Lie. Now, that is a really nice jury song. I I wouldn't be surprised to see that almost win the jury of the 25%, but is it going to have that broad televote appeal? Hmm, not sure. We saw an upset last year. We could see another one this year, but it's a bit more of an open race than people think. However, I think overall predictions have to go with Blind Channel. I think they stand out. I think they've got appeal on both sides and I uh, will predict them for the UMK victory. And the final national final where they're deciding uh, the artist, well, <laughs> not the artist, we already know it's going to be Blas Canto, uh, but Spain with Destino Eurovision. We've got two songs. It's a head-to-head -head battle. We're not going digital like San Marino. We actually do have a national final gala that's happening, so God knows how long this will take to decide who's going to win out of two songs. But um, we are favoring number one in terms of prediction and also the Aussie Vision ranks. It is his ballad, Voy a Qued Dame. Uh, yes, we think that's probably going to take it out. I think it really suits his voice. He should be able to smash this out. Spain have done well with ballads. They want to do well again. Um, I think he'll do a really good performance of this. I think the only question mark there is if he doesn't, he has to nail this as well because there's some really interesting moments, particularly with that um, high range he does. If he misses it badly, perhaps the Spanish people will go for the more, I guess, um, safe uh, mid-tempo uh, memoria song um, but remember there has been voting before the lives as well so stage one voting is happening right now you can vote I can vote we can all vote but uh, stage two is um, for the live show itself tomorrow morning Australian time so that's our quick uh, rankings and predictions for all the songs taking place tomorrow on this big weekend um, let's see how right or wrong we end up being but enjoy the shows thanks guys